I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will understand what is area of a sector. So we have a circle here and let us say this is the center of the circle. In that case we can form a sector by joining from the center two points on the circumference. So the area which we get in between is called the area of the sector. So this is a sector, correct? Now what we are interested in finding is what can be the area of this particular sector. So let us say that this sector is at O and the radius of the circle is R. So we can have a general expression for that area of the sector. You know, what is the area of a circle? Now area of the circle is equals to pi R square, correct? First, we will do measurements in degrees. In degrees, you know, full circle is how much? In degrees, we have full circle is, uh, full circle is 360 degrees, right? Now, let us assume that this angle here is theta degrees. In that case, from the rotational symmetry of the circle itself, what should be the area of this particular sector? So it is in the ratio, right? So we can say area of the sector. Let me draw it in the shape. So that's kind of easy for us to, instead of writing sector, should be equal to how much? It should be equals to pi r square, only a part which is enclosed within theta out of 360, right? So that particular ratio, theta over 360 degrees. Right, so that becomes the formula for area of the sector when angle is measured in degrees. If you do measurements in radians, in that case you will get the same formula as pi r square and in radians one full circle is 2 pi. So you get theta divided by 2 pi. So that is in radians, right? Now that can be simplified further and we can write this formula as pi and pi cancel, correct? So let's cancel this, simplify it a bit. So we get half r square theta, do you see that? So that becomes the formula for area of sector if you are given the dimensions in radians, angle dimensions, correct? Now, as an exercise, what you can do is you can solve some questions related to this, right? So, let's say question number one, you are given radius of 10 centimeters and, and theta is 120 degrees. Find area of sector, right? This is find area of sector. So, that could be one of your questions. And in the second question, let us say you need to find the area of the sector and let us take radius as equals to 6 centimeters and theta equals to pi by 3, right? So find area of the sector for these two cases, right? That should be a good exercise. I hope you understand how we derive the formula. So the formula basically is the ratio of the area covered from the whole. So that gives you the area of the sector. Thank you and all the best.